Hello Guardians, Destiny is almost upon us and you want to know which secondary weapon you should take to the Crucible. I'm here to help. I was banging seven grand rocks as I rolled. I got one gear go. Are you bipolar? What is up guys, Chris here and welcome to episode 2 of my Destiny weapon guide. Today we're covering the secondary category which features the sniper rifles, shotguns and fusion rifles. Let's hop right into it. Sniper Rifles Sniper Rifles of course need no introduction. High powered long range rifles with high magnification scopes. Within Destiny this weapon category is unique in the way that it's the only weapon capable of getting a one shot kill at any range. While you will need a headshot to achieve this, it's a very very strong benefit to have. Though due to the scope it's not very effective at short ranges. Of course accurate players can succeed at short range but it's going to be very inconsistent. While the recoil is very high, it's not a factor due to the low rate of fire, usually below 100 rounds per minute. The capacity of the magazines are 3 to 4 rounds, though there may be snipers in the full release that can carry more rounds. Snipers are ideal for long range maps and maps with many long lines of sight. You'll need to play conservatively with these weapons, but if you manage to hit the head all the time, you'll succeed all the time with snipers. Within Destiny there's almost no better feeling than getting that one shot kill with your sniper. While you most likely won't be able to go around quickscoping people like in certain other first person shooters, you'll definitely have fun with the snipers if you like to pick off people at a distance. Snipers are, in my opinion, the second strongest secondary weapon category. Shotguns Shotguns are close range powerhouses, though they're really nothing more than this. The rate of fire is very very low and it has extremely extremely low range. While it of course is very high damage, it's gonna drop off after just a few meters, leaving you defenseless with these weapons. The capacity is between 4 and 6 rounds and while these weapons are of course very powerful within their effective range, they're very inconsistent. This is due to the box shot nature of the gun. It doesn't fire one solid round, but many smaller rounds. You'll only succeed in ultra close quarters with these guns though they're very good backups for hand cannons and scout rifles if you've damaged your enemy already. If you've damaged your enemy already, you can easily finish them off with a shotgun at close range. I unfortunately found the shotguns to be rather ineffective. Destiny simply features too many open lines of sight for the shotguns to succeed, and even in close corridors, they can be ineffective if you can't turn fast enough. Which brings up another issue, the sensitivity. Do you want to have more reactivity or better aim? You'll often have to give up the aim in order to succeed with the shotgun because you need the reactivity. While shotguns can be powerful if you know how to use them, I didn't find them particularly good. B. Fusion Rifles Fusion rifles are directed energy weapons for close quarters combat. The rate of fire is extremely low due to the charge up, but if you hit your enemy, they will quite literally turn into dust. The damage is extremely high, but low range, though better range than the shotguns. They can be considered to be the lower fire rate but higher range shotguns and I often find this to be a good trade off. The magazine capacity is between 5 and 7 rounds and you can easily take down multiple enemies with one magazine. The most powerful fusion rifles are arguably the best secondary weapons in Destiny. The added range compared to the shotguns make them extremely extremely powerful in the corridors where the shotguns often tend to suffer. The fusion rifles are high school high reward weapons that are extremely powerful at close range and is a great backup for scout rifles who tend to suffer in close ranges. In my opinion these are the best guns in the secondary category. I hope you enjoyed episode 2 of my destiny weapon guides. If you did make sure to leave a like and if you're new subscribe for more awesome destiny content. There will be plenty more coming up in the near future once the full release of Destiny comes out. So stay tuned and I'll see you on my next video. Peace.